No, currently no limit to the amount of power storage you can install. I've seen talk of them re-implementing a slot system for uh, CBMs. That would be like <laughs> nerf number six of the whole CBM system. All right, so, so unfortunately we keep picking up stuff. We're way overweight again. And carrying around this jackhammer is stupid heavy. Um, I've forgotten where I came into this place at, too. Hmm. Let's... Bullshit. <laughs> Eat it when they blow that much ammo on a stupid little turret. Safer, though. I'll accidentally wander my way into that turret here if I don't. Alright, don't need it. Uh, don't need it at the moment. Got standard 8x40 loaded currently. Um... My light goggles are almost out again. Water's taken care of. Back down we go. Okay, nothing to do north. The containment room with lots of light. Scientists this time. Oh, we have Shoggoth again. Hey, Shoggoth. Uh, yes. Ah, crap. The blobs are loose. Um, still in this middle room. In here and here. We 
way south. This is blobs shot by a turret. Yep, this is blob shot by a turret, and then the turret ran out of ammo. Hey, Mr. Turret. All right, no doors west or south. No reason for us to stick around here. Up into containment, so I'm gonna assume that dead ends down that way as well. Yep, long corridor ends in a containment. Alright, don't care about containments. The way south, we already did that. I think we're done. Yep, that's it for this floor. So... Floor 2 is done. That stairs got blobs in it, I believe. Big hey, ready bag. The big daddy. <laughs> big daddy, ready bag. <laughs> Let's go back to that room. That had a fairly conveniently placed up down. All right. Um. Yeah. So, straight down into a fungal. That's fine. I think I, yeah, I've been here before. Door. Door open. No door that way. So, north south. Let's go north. Prisoner containment. Don't care. South is our only choice. Other containments. Medical. Uh, I guess. Not that I'm going to use it. Just in case we need cooking level ups for some reason. Another stair down. Damn it! Ah. Let's go uh, south. South. Hmm. They broke the computer. I don't know whether that's going to be a mutagen vault or a bionic vault. But I'm pretty sure this is going to be another, this long corridors like this is a connector to a uh, barracks or a containment or a library. Let's find out first. That's useless. That's the same thing, useless. And we got library. Alright, um, I'm not going to try to... 
not gonna try to hack that. Hey, hey first LMAO. off. <laughs> hey, LMAO to you too. Happy LMAO day. We're just gonna jackhammer it. Come on, library. Oh, this one's got stuff. Vending machines are always broke. All right, not always. What do we got? Spetsnaz, knife techniques. Don't need that. Oh, knife fighter's notes. Already got all these. There's a Knife Fighter's convention going on or something? Like, like four copies of the Knife Fighter notes? Alright, well... I honestly don't care about any of these. So, that was a bust. A lot of books. None of them useful, unfortunately. And we are well overweight again. Um... I don't need to drop that. Just need to get rid of that completely so I can stand in that space. Then we can jackhammer the door. Actually... Alright. No light meaning no turret. That was a mutation one. Spider serum exciting, not really. And two empty syringes. <laughs> All right, so this whole section is a dead end. <laughs> Spiders in the machinery. Stupid spiders, aren't you? <laughs> Damn super fast web spider. The hell, man? That thing's as fast as I am on rollerblades? That's kind of funny. Hey, marksmanship 2. Cool. That thing was hella fast. More mutagens. More spiders. Um, well, the spiders are blocking both routes. I'm going to have to get rid of them. I think we're going to have to go with the, uh, the blades. Yeah. Get some spiders. Damn it, it's open to not get re poisoned. I 
There's a bionic vault. Fortunately, it's another one of those ones where I could get shot if I'm not careful. Ah, I think that's it. No other crates to open. the vault as before. We'll stand here, pop the door, and then depending on where the turret is located I might have to uh, might have to EMP it, but uh, best case if there is a turret I can make it around the corner or we'll work our way around the loop and then I'll open this door and we'll shoot it from range. So, that's the plan. If that doesn't work for whatever reason. We'll just toss an EMP grenade in after it. Yeah, another one. No turret, no nothing. <laughs> of course. Damn it! Bit of a pile of these guys. One at a time, please. Hey! One at a time, I said. Um, don't care. Nothing I care about. Alright, any others? Adderall. Ain't never have too much Adderall. Man, we're dead tired. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright, that's pushing it a bit. Let's go ahead and work our way back out. Oops. Uh... That's yeah, fine. Let's go up the way we know is safe-ish. Well, it's that time again where we get to go uh, try to do some uninstalls before I go to sleep. Although, uh, I think when I'm dead tired, I lose some points. Hmm. Uh oh. What the hell did we break? Uh, I'm not sure what got broke there. Whatever. Um, wow, where did all the weight come from? Just those 
few books. God, I need to go kill that guy just to get him to shut up. Even if he is one of my cyborg buddies. Actually, let's do that. Let's let's make an attempt to recruit or convert one of these guys. Um, all right. So dump all those. Temporarily dump this, so I don't have to deal with a weight problem. And we'll dump the storm as well. All right. Good to go there. All right, I got EMP grenades. We're going to try to EMP him to an inactive state and uh, then take him down to the auto dock. All right. See, now I'm, I'm getting so confused. So did something break my anesthesia that was laying on the ground? I just... <laughs> I don't understand, and I'm getting really annoyed. I've had Anastasia or Anesthetic Kits disappear on me multiple times so far this run, and it's really starting to tick me off. I'm going to start summoning the stuff because I'm getting more than a little annoyed. Either tools, yeah. The only thing they're showing for anesthetic is the empty anesthesia kits. And I had just dropped a new one off. At least one. I mean, we've come across a number of these stupid things recently. And now I've got zero in the area again. I've got this set to inventory. I have... None in my inventory currently. And when I search all for anesthetic, I've got this. I... <sighs> I hate doing stuff like this, but I'm going to start summoning anesthetic kits. Because this run is screwed if anesthetic kits keep disappearing on me. I know I've lost one previously, and now I've lost another one. Waste a bunch of time. Move this stuff out of the way. God damn it. Here we go, having to hit a hit escape a million times. <laughs> this mechanic is so stupid. I really, really hate this mechanic. Because it's so stupid. Fuck, that's annoying. <laughs> Oh crap, I tried to move again. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, no matter what you hit, you're still screwed. <laughs> Alright, stop. Stop hauling. Uh, what a mess. So that's denatured alcohol on the ground there. Right there. So it's not the anesthetic kit. Or some weird circumstance. I know I left, didn't I leave anesthetic kits down there as well? But I know I brought one back and I left it right here. So I'm, I'm more than a little annoyed. Where earplugs? Drag. Drag. <laughs> Stupid. Gotta make yourself deaf in order to move inventory around. Alright, I think it's time for an MRE. Asian beef and vegetables. Sounds good. Oh yeah. So activate the dessert pack. Gotta have the dessert pack.
All right. One, two, three, four. Cheese spread. That's eh, probably going to be enough. Yeah, my int has dropped by two because we're dead tired. I shouldn't have let myself get to the dead tired stage. Um, I don't think trying to pep myself up is going to help enough either. Too much time's gone by. Oh, hey, zombie. Oh, we got a, a crew of zombies working their way through the little alleyway there. Um, well, this is not convenient. Got my blades out, but I've also got all these backpacks on. Yeah, yeah, I know, guys. You're gonna rip apart my duffel bag while I'm... God damn! the hell am I getting hit a million times? Now I've got a bite already, and I got massive damage when I was at full strength a second ago? That was weird. That was... that was weird. <laughs> that was just odd. Seemed like I was moving super, super slow, and they were getting a whole crap load of attacks all at once. Well, yeah, climbing around on my cargo carrier with my rollerblades was not good to begin with. Um... I mean, I don't care about the damage. I'm about to go to sleep anyway, but it just... That, that felt weird, the way that, that went down. Yeah, let's hope that's it for the moment. Um, yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure I'm down uh, at least one set of three anesthetic. I don't care about any of this right now. We're going to have to do it in reverse order. I'll have to sleep first, and then we'll go check out the next attempt at the uh, auto dock. Yeah, I... Ah! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's funny. I think she literally followed me down from the, from the, sea, from the upper floor. I think she was part of the group... But I just killed that I didn't see. She followed my scent trail all the way downstairs. Because there's been no zombie children <laughs> downstairs. Or or she fell through the roof. But she broke the door here. But I'm, I'm going to give it the benefit of the doubt and say that she came all the way down from upstairs. Go make sure my vehicles aren't getting trashed. No, nope, don't see anybody. But yeah, it's that's some nonsense there. <laughs> Try again. No, there's no alternative. You can craft them theoretically, and I think they've changed the process a bit. But when they first introduced it, it was so ridiculously time and material difficult. I just, as soon as I figured out what you had to do to get any, I said, nope, no thanks. So, yeah, anesthetic kits are one of the many barriers they've put in front of trying to do CBMs. The glory days of having cybernetic warrior gods strolling the landscape 60, uh, well, not even 60, 30 days into a challenge is uh, long gone. They keep ratcheting down, ratcheting down, ratcheting down the uh, CBM process. Which I'm, I'm okay with to a certain degree. My big issue is still just the... Uh, reported numbers they give me for installs and uninstalls still does not hold up to actual empirical data, not even remotely. Alright, um, and we're still tired. That's fine, we're gonna get some sleep while we kill ourselves trying to uninstall a CVM. Uh, how do I not have that room right there actually identified? Did map memory selectively decide to remove one room? No? Apparently, how the hell did I not go here before? Really? How did, <laughs> how did I not <laughs> explore this room? 
Hmm. Seems a little funky. Let's go take a look. If I've got a bunch of anesthetic here, fine. Three, four total. I'm, I'm still sure I'm one short from what I should have with the number of or a number of auto docs we found. Whatever. Um, turret room above it, so I avoided it. Is that all it was? That seems a little odd, given how many different directions I can come at the, the rooms. But all right. Alright, um, so same plan as before. We'll try to do an uninstall first. So let's go with the uh, of a cigarette and the Adderall. That only gets me to yeah, 13 plus 5. That's what we were doing before. Alright, uninstall. We were doing the vision. Where are you, visual disruptor? Ooh, 42. How the hell am I at 42? Is that right? Is that just harder than the other one? By 5%? No, the tired state... I don't... Shouldn't have any effect on that. I mean, tired is already dropping stats and things like that. But, um... Hmm. Seems weird. So we're sitting at 38% fail on the enhanced memory banks, 21 to get my dielectric back in after the goddamn nurse took it out. Oh, curse you nurse. If you, uh, if I fail this one, I'm going to get so unhappy. Hmm. Um. Nah, let's 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 do it. Visual disruptor, forty-two percent fail chance. We failed. So it took us five attempts to get the thirty-eight percent out. <laughs> Uh, we'll sit here a little while longer. I'm gonna get the stimulants out. I'm willing to give it one more shot. I gotta wait out the stupid visual disruptor again. Alright. Cigarette. Cigarette gives us the stimulants, yeah. Adderall. It's to 13. Whoops. Uh, whatever I just hit. <laughs> All right, opportunity number two. No, not voice for modulator. Visual disruptor. Hey, we got it out on the second try. That's more closely to what it should be. Still haven't taken any damage. Still got a little bit of stimulus. Do I press for another one? So we've gotten three of the bad bionics out so far. Still got a ways to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more to go. At the current fail rates, that's uh, what? Between like 20 and 50 <laughs> anesthetic kits just to get these out. All right, but no more hallucinations, no more dropping of my eyesight. There's the visual disruptor and the bionic short circuit. We left the leaky bionic back at wherever we first uninstalled it. But uh, that's the worst of them. So now we're down to... What would be the next one? 
That just makes a little noise. I'm not really concerned about that. Stiffness is <laughs> encumbrance. <laughs> hey there, attack. Thanks for the laugh. Um, possibly the motor control over stimulator. This one's the one that makes me fall down on my face occasionally. So it's that one, the one that makes me tired faster, or the encumbrance. And I think it's probably going to be one of these two. I think the making me tired faster is probably having a larger effect right now. What's the number look like? If we try that one, 70. And if we try that one, also. All right, so the same numbers. Um, I'm down to uh, two kits left because it's cheated me again. I've done two attempts. I'm really still trying to avoid going into Adderall addiction. Well, it's 70 before I uh, crank up my intelligence. It'll be 42 to 50 when I when I get it cranked up. 70 does seem a little higher than the other ones, though, for a starting point. <laughs> um, I'm only going to gain... I think it's going to drop 20, so I think it's going to be 50. So it's going to be a 50-50 coin flip. Assuming I don't... Uh, Increase my skills that are involved. First aid, electronics, and mechanics. And computers. So, yeah, that's, that's the reason why this is a pretty hard challenge, trying to get rid of all these negative bionics. It's access to the damn anesthetic kits. It's the, uh, the roadblock. Which is why I get pretty goddamn annoyed when my anesthetic kits disappear on me. Um, yeah. Do I try one more? I'm going to try one more. Let's try to get the enhanced memory banks in. <laughs> Why would they be disappearing? I, I've had issues with the stack management, especially around vehicles in the past, where things have just vaporized. It's not an, it's not an unusual thing. It's happened uh, a number of times in the past. But um, It's pretty annoying when it's a specific item you really need to have, and you can only get small amounts of them. That's when you really notice it. Uh, so, let's wait another 30 minutes. Um, I, I just know I'm going to get an Adderall addiction. <laughs> Alright, let's try it, though. Cigarettes. Adderall. Install. 38%. Mm. We failed. <laughs> Damn it. As usual, my fail rate, it tells me it's 38%. It's actually coming in at like 60 to 70%. <laughs> so, as always. <clears throat> uh, I can't take any more disappointments. <laughs> I, I, I gotta take it in small doses. Uh, yeah. We're one for... One for six on 38% chance removals. <clears throat> Alright. Um, yeah. I can't, I can't do another one. Let's put some time behind us so we don't... Uh, just immediately hammer myself into Adderall addiction. Um, let's see. No! <laughs> God damn it! Ugh.
How many of my vehicles are they tearing up? Uh, well, they've about destroyed my, uh, my constructor. Either excavator. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's well and truly tore up. All right. Well, at least they didn't blow up the boom crane. Diesel leaking? Do I need to get the diesel out of this thing? Where are you at, diesel? Oh, no. Nope. Tank's still in good shape. Yeah, I was I was worried about that. That's why I've been trying to peek out here every once in a while. I knew the wander spawns would eventually just screw me. That's what they just did. Yeah, just a uh, wandering horde out of nowhere out in the middle of the fields. <laughs> Like, hey everybody, let's just uh, teleport in and then go right through this vehicle into the lab to go talk to that guy who just came up the stairs. Just, just, just totally random circumstance. <laughs> would have helped if I had left the doors open. Or started moving it away. It would have been better if I had moved it, actually, and not have it blocking this. At a certain point, I only do this super early game. So I, I probably should have parked it elsewhere. Um, so towards that, let's, um, fails to start. Do we have a battery anymore? Yeah, we have no battery. Uh, is that because I pulled the battery? No, I parked it here, so it had a battery, and it got destroyed, apparently. Or is it sitting up in the, uh, the vehicle? I forget. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not showing the battery here, so I must have uh, moved it and not put it back. Alright. <clears throat> well, that wasn't unexpected. I kind of figured that would happen without too much more time going by. Uh, so yeah, good news on good news. Good times. Where are you? Oh my god. Your plug's in, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, makes me laugh. Oh, that's right. I had all of my stuff there, didn't I? Alright, now I'm getting kind of a... Ah, oh, doesn't have enough wheels. <laughs> uh, they blew the wheels off. Yep, rear wheels have been completely removed. Need at least one 17 inch wheel to get that thing moving again. Or of any other kind. Um. Alright, well I think the days of the excavator are about done. <laughs> I think it'll be Humvee moving forward from here. I just need to um, get the boom crane and the gas moved out of here. All right, they can actually step on or through most of those spaces once they finish coming through the windshields. There's really nothing preventing them from moving through, so it's fine where it's at. We'll just let it die a. Ignoble death right there at the front of the lab. 
I'll be a little sad, but not too much. Oh, you gotta play with Wander Spawns. It has its irritating points, but uh, not playing with them is such a dead world. So, so easy to cheese it. I just can't stand playing without it. I grumble when it happens, but um, it throws the wild card in and makes things a little more interesting. Alright, um... Well, I'd pull the Boom Crane, except that uh, they can walk right through it. So they're not likely... That, that's why I was moving the way I was. They can just walk right through here. They won't actually impact it trying to get through the uh, vehicle. So they've pretty much gotten everything except for the windshields. <laughs> the, 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 the thing they could have gotten through the easiest is what they did not get through, the windows. They get right through the frames and the, uh, the boards and so on on every other space. <laughs> and they left the front windshield. So, I'm not too concerned about it. I, I can make a boom crane pretty quick. Regardless. Or a pallet lifter. Pretty much anything else. I've got all the materials right here in this area now. So we'll see. Uh, Alright. Dump despair. Remember to swap out my army jacket next time we're in a barracks, too. No, it wouldn't let me put a uh, cargo space in anything except for that back trunk area. None of the other locations were valid. Carrying something that's guess I just added enough because of the combat knife and such. Let's let's dump the combat. Activate combat knife. I'm never gonna use that when I've got the bionic claws anyway. Uh, activate. Oh, that's right. I've got the claws out. <laughs> All right, fine. Just drop the sheep with the knife in it. Um, I'm running just a little bit heavy. Got rifles. Rifles at ninety-eight percent. Marksmanship leveled up, but rifles is still low. Yeah, that's fine. We'll, we'll go as this. Uh, I've forgotten which route I was taking. Um, <laughs> nah, I'm not concerned about tailoring and stuff yet. I don't really. I, I what happens is. It's none of the regular zombie stuff is going to kill me. It's it's I'm either going to instantly die to a turret or I'm going to be fine. So working on my clothing is kind of irrelevant when I'm rolling around in labs. If all I'm going to do is roll around in a lab, that kind of stuff has no bearing on whether I'm going to survive or not. So spending the time on it is kind of pointless. So usually I'll just end up uh, getting the immediate things I want or need and then sitting down with a bunch of MREs and pine... Uh, pine nuts <laughs> and um, water supply and just mass grind through a bunch of books to uh, get my fab and tailoring up. Then I smash together some survivor gear and off I go. Or whatever gear I've decided to use for that particular challenge run. But I tend to jump from trash things I pick up and use as I go along to end game gear. <laughs> There's not usually a midpoint for me. Um, just kind of depends a little bit on what character I'm running to. But uh I'm outfitted well enough now where, like I said, it's it's really a moot point. 
So right now we're on an anesthetic kit tour and a barracks tour and just kind of exploring this one lab. Alright, that's all fine. That gets us back to where or the level we were on earlier. And I think I had worked my way around. So nowhere to go. Finished it up. Nowhere to go, nowhere to go. Alright, so we're here. Or here. So yeah, we're almost done with this floor too, it looks like. So the first floor was pretty big. Hey there, Mr. Teleporter and Herrera. Well, with Herrera, that gives us... I think I already had robots for fun and profit. But if not, that basically gives us the uh, control laptop. Teleporter. I don't want to... Do I want a teleporter? Note. Teleporter. If I ever decide I need it for some reason. All right. <laughs> no, nurse bot. Ah, nurse bot. <laughs> like, yay, auto doc. Boo, nurse bot. Troglobite serum and another cranial flashlight. Well, the first, the nurses weren't hostile previously until they scanned me and then grabbed me and threw me on the uh, the table. As soon as I get close enough, she'll scan me. Hey there, Nurse Bot. Don't know if she can do it through the glass if it's a proximity thing. No. Nurse Bot's ignoring me. Doesn't say friendly, just says ignoring. Alright, you better not disappear on me, Anesthesia, anesthesia Kit. Getting pretty pissed off about that whole thing. Uh, none of my prototype buddies. Just the shock zombie. And I don't have my dielectric in, <laughs> so I can't easily kill him. I'll leave him alone. Note. Auto dock. Uh, up. Auto dock with nurse. Not messing with the nurse. All right, where to go but south? Ay, uh, ay, ouch. Ah, there's guns. There's uh, sentry bots in here. There are roving sentry bots in here. And I am still undecided about them being able to shoot in the dark. Uh, we're going to save. Oops. <laughs> Didn't mean that one. Give me your backup water bottle. I thought I had been scanned by the previous nurse, nurse through the glass. So, I don't know if the different conditions um, dictate. Alright, we get shot to death, which is a possibility, given the way these things are currently working. Hopefully they're out of bullets and they're just wandering around. But if I do get shotted, we'll be uh, save scumming. Hey there, Shrieker Zombie and Security Bot. <laughs> Security Bot has to be out of bullets. We'll let them just do their little thing. That's another Security Bot with another Zombo. <laughs> Bird mutagen or bird serum, standard mutagen, charcoal, don't care. No way to go south from here. If there's no way west or east, then we're done on this floor. This is the last room on this floor. So we'll go up north. Or we'll take this. Nah, I don't want to take this stair. I don't want to scare myself into getting shot again. Hydrogen tank, huh? Uh, given the number of labs I'm going into, it'd probably be a good idea to grab that hydrogen tank. Uh, 
So we do have a door to the east. And good old purifier. All right, we'll grab the purifier just in case I accidentally mutate. Prisoner containment. I don't care about prisoner containment. All right, we're out of here. Okay, uh, floor three is done. We got one floor to go. Ooh, eight showing up in lit areas. That one looks pretty safe, though. All right, and you can see we've already done possibly the whole place. Um, and this is the one that has the uh, train depot connection. I'm not sure... Yeah, that one's down to the finale room. Yeah, I can't remember. I don't remember when our, on our first time through here if um, I fully explored this or if we were just going until I found the uh, the exit. How overweight am I? Uh, I'm a bit overweight. Stupid uh, hydrogen canister probably weighs a lot. Yeah, I'm still deep. <laughs> I keep making myself deep because the uh, stupid movement system and interruption system. Hmm. Hmm. All right, let's drop a few things here. Whoa, no, no good stuff. Wow, that kind of sucks. All right, fine, be that way. I am thirsty. I guess we'll grab, uh, what, sports drink? No tea, mineral water. And we'll grab a couple sports drink. already covered this room. Where to go? 